Guys, this is how we're going to be doing nebulizations in ICU for the oxygen cages or in the respiratory isolation. Um, we have our irrigation saline, we have a tube for our nebulizer unit, we have our canister and our lid, and then we have the connection from the canister to the oxygen cage. These are in the drawers in ICU or they are in isolation. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to pour some of your saline into your canister. We're going to attach our lid here and our little tube. The connection that goes into the oxygen cage has two ends. You're going to want to do the screw end into the top of the canister and it just tightens on like so. And then we're ready to hook the unit up to our oxygen cage. Um, for the oxygen cage, you want to make sure that your oxygen cage is already at 40% because we're going to be turning the oxygen cage off. So what you're going to want to do is the cages have a holder for the nebulizer. We're going to stick the tube into the oxygen cage port. It holds the canister right here. And then we're going to take the other part of our connector and just stick it into this hole right here and it clicks in. You can hear it already starting and it's starting to kick out smoke. The problem is, is that we leave it like this with the oxygen cage still on. You're sucking out your oxygen because your cage is circulating. So you're going to want to just turn your cage off and then your cage will now fill the direction of the smoke changed. Your oxygen cage will now fill with your nebulized saline um, and you're ready to nebulize your patient. You can do it for about 10 minutes or so. You don't want to do this with large dogs because your large dogs will get too humid. Um, so those you probably have to do by hand with like flow by oxygen and a hand nebulizer um, or do it for less time so your cage doesn't get too humid. Um, and then once you turn your cage on, you will have to restart your oxygen and your temperature control, but then it'll suck out all of the extra nebulizer um, steam in there, if you will. Um, and then you're ready to go. But that's how you do your nebulizing.